Okay, so we've arrived safe and sound at our hotel and it is incredible. I'm gonna give you a little tour. Matthew's walking around in his pants, so hang on. This is the bathroom. As you can see, we have a shower, bath, awesome dresser, and then the toilet's in here. And then we're gonna, that's it all. And then we're gonna walk into here. This is our lounge area. We've got tea and coffee, a complimentary fruit bowl, and some chocolates, I think they are, and some TV. Oh, look, it's your favorite person, Matthew. Jason Statham. Oh, yeah. And then this is a walk-in wardrobe. This is our bedroom. And then it's a shame because it's nighttime now, but we have a balcony and it looks out. You can't see it because it's so dark on this camera, but it looks out over the water. Down there are like palm trees and little things. Oh my goodness, I'm stuck in the net. <laughs> I'm stuck in the curtain. Tomorrow I will show you it in the daytime because it's incredible. <gasps> Over and out. Okay, so it's the first morning. I'm on the balcony. Matthew is still snoring away. I wanted to be up to have a look at everything. I have to show you the view because this is incredible. This is the resort that we're staying on. This is our private beach area. These are these little beds that we can sit on, lay on and chill. And I'm gonna go in and get some breakfast, I think. And leave him here because he doesn't want to eat. We just went and had some breakfast. It was amazing. I went into a shop because they have like shops in this place that I'm staying. And I just started talking to this guy that owns the shop and uh, he was like, what's your name? So I was like, Helen. And he gave me this bookmark and on the back he wrote my name in Arabic. And then he said, who are you on holiday with? So I said, uh, my boyfriend. And he gave me this little scarab beetle. He says it's for good luck. I'm now going to go back to the room and wake Matthew up because he's been asleep for far too long. And um, I'm going to go swimming. <laughs> Is like we had a bit of everything didn't we yeah. but what I love is the fact that I can have like one two three four four different desserts but I could have had more than that but I opted these ones and Matthew's having a never round of chips Thomas Cook quality yeah I know right thanks Thomas Cook and he's had about how many beers have you had they just keep coming even though we had a buffet style meal Matthew ordered burger and chips on the room service at midnight. So the waiter guy was like, do you want another beer? And Matthew was like, yeah, I'll have 10 more, please. And the guy was like, oh, okay. And then Matthew went, take it to room 261. And then we literally got back to our room about 15 minutes later. It happens. <laughs> and it was only sort of a joke, wasn't it? Morning of day two, and um, we're heading to some breakfast. Matthew didn't want to go, but I managed to pry him out of bed and come with me. Oops. So I'm gonna go and get some cocktails now. I think it's an appropriate time. It's gone midday, so I think having cocktails mm -hmm. is, is all right. <laughs> it is super hot today, like so much hotter than it was yesterday. Um, I'm also finding out about our excursions because we booked through Thomas Cook and we also booked a bunch of excursions so I'm um, just waiting on the info from the hotel. shopping mall across the road from our complex. So I want some snacks because there's a supermarket here as well. My back is absolutely dripping with sweat. 
Bumblebee. Bumblebee. Wearing my pineapple swimming costume. Oh, oh. If you like pina colada and getting caught in the rain, Matthew's gonna go with the GoPro into the sea. had to get up so super early because um, we're going on an excursion today which is swimming with dolphins. <laughs> decided to run out of battery just as I wanted to use it even though I charge it all night um, I don't actually know why it just didn't want to turn on I tried resetting it whatever anyway so I had to we went in the sea on our bow tip so I can't show you what happened but basically we went in and there was like tons and tons of lovely fish and coral and then we um, got on another little boat and we ended up swimming with some dolphins and I'm with some moon. And it's quite sad because today is our last full day in Egypt. I'm going to breakfast on my own because he's in bed. Oh, so I'm going to go and have breakfast and then I'm going to wake him up and we're going to go and sit in the cabana. So I'm early. Today we are being treated to a cabana which is a private part of the beach and you have like a little house like this and you have two little beds and a table and two sun beds and there's quite a few and you have curtains 